Hi everyone, Morgan Schimmel here at Top Spa in Allen, Texas, and this is week four of our skin game competition. So today, we are going to start off just kind of how we did last week. Last week, y'all saw us, we did our first hydrofacial for Chelsea. It was really great at going in and detoxing her skin and getting all of her makeup build up out. At the end of her facial, we could really see all of the gunk that kind of collected in the machine, and we could really tell that there was some trap makeup in there. So we got her to start cleansing her face a little bit more deeply each night just to make sure that she's getting all of her makeup off. And then after, we're gonna go in and do the Circadia Cocoa enzyme treatment again just like y'all saw in week one. The enzyme is going to be great for loosening up any bacteria, dead skin debris that she's kind of accumulated from her microneedling and then we're going to go in again with that oxygen RX treatment by Circadia. That's going to be my most favorite treatment we have for her because it's so made, it's made especially for her skin type. Her redness, her sensitivity, her acne scarring, she's prone to having um, a little bit, not necessarily rosacea, but just kind of um, irritation along her cheeks, a really dry, irritated red skin. So that's why the oxygen treatment is great for that. It's creating a controlled amount of oxygen on her epidermal layer, killing any bacteria, softening the sebum, which is basically the oil production in the skin, calming down any inflammation, um, really tightening and firming her skin and getting her skin right back on track so next week we can go in and do her second microneedling. Since Chelsea's skin is kind of still in that healing phase but getting more um, resilient, I guess getting ready for that second microneedling, her healing has kind of slowed down, we added in our Circadia Daytime Control. This is going to be great for calming down those active breakouts that she's sometimes getting, you know, basically the pustules and zits that she's getting from her makeup and from just, you know, her normal acne skin that she does have. So Daytime Control has um, salicylic acid which is great for uplifting any oil and debris and dirt that's kind of accumulated through her day, drying it out on the surface and really basically controlling her oil production in her skin. The last product that I want to introduce y'all to is going to be the Circadian Nighttime Control. This is going to be what we have Chelsea on every single night following her microexfoliating cleanser, her vitamin C serum, and her Chrono Calm serum. This Nighttime Control Moisturizer is going to be great for basically balancing out the surface lipids and proteins in her skin. And of course, last we are going to finish Chelsea's treatment with the Light Stem LED Panel. The, what the Light Stem Panel is really going to do is basically synergistically make all of our treatments work together, really get her skin cells nice and activated, give those skin cells the energy that they need to really go in and repair her tissue, plump up that collagen, calm down any redness, and basically just icing on top of the cake for her treatment today. Thanks guys for watching today. This is week four of the skin games. I can't believe that it's already been halfway. Chelsea is loving her product. She's loving her results, which just makes me so happy. And I can't wait for the next four weeks and stay tuned for week five. Bye.